Fryer. We'll get you out of here with this. Which game's money line or spread do you like tonight? It's at 10 points now. Warriors are the favorites with Job Moran expected to miss. Yeah, I, I, you know, of course he's doubtful and I can't help but look at that one a little bit, but I'm going to go with Celtics money line here. Um, I just think the Celtics are too good a team to go down 3 1 in this series. They've made adjustments. I do think as much as I have been a little critical about Jason Tatum and the whole top five player hype. I do think to some extent like he's that's warranted. And I think that he is going to step up tonight. And I think Jalen Brown has responded to that struggling first game as well. So I think that the Celtics, they have the personnel to at least slow down Giannis, where I think that, again, we've seen him beat him already once this series. I know it's tougher on the road in Milwaukee, but there's no way with, that Ime Udoka is going to let his team come back uh, to Boston down 3-1. Maddie, what bet do you like? Nick's going with the pick that my heart wants to make with the Celtics. Like, I really I really want to be confident that they'll win, but this is too close to a coin flip for me to, like, really be confident betting this game. I just hope they win so they can get back and win this series. But the, the more logical pick, the pick that I think is actually more of a value here is Memphis getting the points. And I thought this line was going to be inflated already if Morant played. Obviously, there have been a couple points added to it because he's doubtful. During this season, I think we all know at this point, the Grizzlies were just fine without Ja Morant. And I think it's a little different in the playoffs because Morant's defense has really picked up. So they're probably losing a little bit more without Morant than they would have, say, two, three, four months ago. But I still think this is a really good team, even without Morant playing. I think the Warriors are still going to feel the loss of Gary Payton and Andre Iguodala a little bit where their defense is not great. Um, so this game should be a little closer. Memphis should be highly motivated to even up this series. I don't think they win it, but 10 points is a lot. And I think the, the line should probably be a little bit lower than that. 